making forecasts is becoming more and more difficult, BMW's chief Harold Kruger told journalists. Profitability is obviously under pressure. It was enough to keep plenty of key players at home, Ford, Fiat Chrysler, Nissan, VW and Mazda were among the notable absences at this year's show. Faced with the reluctance of some industry giants to spend millions of euros on marketing, organizers responded by cutting back the show's length to 11 days from 16. And in a bid to attract crowds who can just as easily compare models on the internet, they set up test tracks where visitors can take electric scooters and bikes for a spin. The show also teamed up with CES Las Vegas, the huge consumer electronics fair, to host dozens of tech start UPS eager to turn cars into the internet-connected mobility solutions of tomorrow. But some analysts say such changes aren't enough, citing a similar absence of major car makers at the industry's other top shows in Detroit, Geneva, or Frankfurt in recent years. The concept needs to be redone from scratch, up to now these shows were just for putting cars next to young girls, said Ferdinand Dudenhofer of Germany's Center for Automotive Research. Frozen, such marketing costs have also become harder to justify as car makers invest billions in autonomous driving and electric motors, even as the outlook for sales darkens. Dudenhofer is expecting global sales to fall 1.4% next year, with declines of 4% in the US and China. But the more immediate worry for European manufacturers is Brexit and the possibility of new duties between Britain and the continent. I don't think that there's any car maker who's not prepared for the worst. We don't like it but we're prepared, he added. BMW's Kruger said Brexit's effects were already being felt. The market is shrinking, and we're selling fewer cars, he said, adding that he too was bracing for a difficult situation. Stress tests, the threats haven't stopped car makers from investing, BMW will spend more money than ever, 7 billion euros, 8.1 billion dollars, on research and development this year, mainly on electric and digital technologies, Kruger said. Both BMW and its German rival Daimler have trimmed profit forecasts for this year, not least because of charges associated with the Diesel Gate emissions cheating scandal. Strict EU limits on CO2 emissions from 2020 have contributed to plunging diesel sales, as has the prospect that many cities could start banning their use to combat smog. That has accelerated the shift to electric, along with the prospect of supplying the huge Chinese market, where officials are strongly encouraging the use of zero-emission vehicles. Renew announced this week a low-cost SUV, the KZE, specifically for the Chinese market but in developed markets electric cars are still a loss-making proposition. The amount of technology on board is going to get bigger and bigger, and the costs higher and higher, said PSA Group Chief Carlos Tavares. He suggested that developing car-sharing systems could be a way of making them more accessible.